A staple in the Edinburgh community for decades is closing at the end of the year. Customers are not happy, and the borough manager says he didn't get any heads up. Brian Wilk joins us in the studio with more on the closing of the Giant Eagle. Brian. Jennifer, the Edinburgh Giant Eagle first opened in 1985. They say it's a difficult but necessary decision. Anger, disappointment, confusion, all emotions after news the Edinburgh Giant Eagle will be closing at the end of the year. I'm very disappointed because ever since we moved out here in 1996, this is where we've done our shopping. I've had kids that worked here and this is my home store. <laughs> I'm going to miss it. She says now she'll have to shop at the local Walmart or take a long drive. Another customer says he isn't looking forward to shopping for his groceries elsewhere. They closed the one in, up in Summit and I, I didn't understand that either, but we don't go to the other one. It's a long way off for us and we got to drive into the city. We aren't going to do that. The borough manager says this is a major concern because it's the only walkable grocery store in the community. He's reached out to elected officials, Giant Eagle, and the company that owns the building to look at their options, but he hasn't heard anything back yet. This is a major issue for our municipality as Giant Eagle is our only grocery store in town and uh, we are one of the lower income municipalities in Erie County. Giant Eagle did release a statement on the planned closure of the Edinburgh Giant Eagle. We have greatly appreciated the support of the Edinburgh community for these many years and thank our team members for their commitment to continually meeting the needs of our guests. Once the store closes, we invite Edinburgh Giant Eagle guests to shop at our Mill Creek Mall Giant Eagle approximately 13 miles north of the closing location. They also say the Edinburgh Giant Eagle Pharmacy will continue to serve the community after the store's closure, moving to an adjacent storefront in the shopping plaza. Sean? Brian Wilk reporting tonight.